This is Robert Kraft, and I'm your host on SNN Network. And joining me right now is Cheryl Grant. She is the president and CEO of Vitality Products, Inc. It's a publicly traded company. The symbol is VPI on the TSX Venture. And Vitality will be presenting at our upcoming virtual event, the SNN Network Canada Virtual Event, which is happening December 7 through 9, 2021. To register, please go to canada.snn.network. With that, Cheryl, thank you so much for joining me today. How are you doing? Great. Thanks for having me today, Robert. It's great to have you on. So this is our first time doing an interview together. So I, I'd love to start off with a quick overview and history of the company, and then we'll go from there. Fantastic. Yeah, well, Vitality, I always say that we're a startup with history. So um, I came into the company about seven years ago now and revitalized the brand name and uh, we really took it from zero dollars in sales and stores and started growing uh, the vitamin and supplement line right back across Canada. So uh, Vitality did have history prior to that. Um, and we saw that there was a lot of great assets here from the brand name to the formulations and we continue to build on that. So we're really excited about where we've gotten the, the brand to. Uh, we're an award-winning line of vitamins and supplements and we consider ourselves an emerging leader in the natural health space. Very good. So can you tell me a little bit about what makes the brand and also the supplements unique and different compared to some of your peers out there? For sure. I think, you know, a lot of people always say to me, I go to the shelves and there's so many products out there. How do you, how do you know why Vitality is better, right? So I think uh, one of the first things that I always let people know is that it can be intimidating and the amount of people who are buying supplements is a multi-billion dollar industry, obviously. Um, but what we did is we took an omni-channel approach. So that means we're available both at the retail stores as well as online. And online is so core to understanding products. So one of the things that we did is we came out with a clean label line. Um, that basically means that it's really easy for customers to understand. It's really effective. Everything's made here in Canada, which is the highest level of standards basically in the world. Um, it's basically Australia and Canada that compete for that. And so that's why I say we have a really clean uh, line, very effective and it's geared to women. And it's a huge advantage to have a woman at the top of, of, of a company like this to understand what those needs are. So some of our products that we've come out are some of the biggest sellers in the industry. And so that's really an advantage point for us. And like I say, we've continued to grow uh, right into leading retailers in Canada, including Whole Foods. We're found on marketplaces like Amazon, and we're also focused on direct-to-customer model of subscription service coming out in later part of this year. So lots of great advantages of the products. Very good. And, and you mentioned that you came into the business about seven years ago. What, what was your experience prior to joining the company? Yeah, it's kind of interesting. I grew up in the natural health industry, so it was family that brought me back into the industry. But uh, I graduated from university and I started off my career in marketing. Um, I worked with advertising agencies for some of the biggest brands in the world, um, wore, moved my way over to Best Buy Canada and oversaw public relations and then into TELUS, one of the largest telcos here in Canada on the advertising. So coming in, uh, my business partner is actually my sibling, um, and he is a, the CFO and has an extensive background in the public markets as well as finance, and I have the marketing and sales side. So I think we're a pretty strong uh, duo here for the growth of the business. You know, I have to ask, you said, you, you know, you said you came into the business about seven years ago. I know we're going back to the history a little bit, but you said you came in when there were zero sales and now, you know, we have omni-channel presence of sales in the company. What were some of the things that you did in order to make sure that, all right, let's, it's time, let's go, let's, let's sell some product. Yeah, well, one of the biggest things is actually starting with your customer base. So I said 80% of women are the customer base, and they're also the buyers of the stores. So uh, it's so key to build relationships in this industry and see what is actually needed out there. How do you punch holes um, to get shelf space uh, in those leading retailers? So met with a lot of the key buyers, I introduced what we were looking at uh, and brought in a product line, including uh, what I call our Lion, which is Power Iron Plus Organic Spirulina. It's won awards in both Canada and the US, extremely effective. And if we can even capture 1% of the supplement industry for just iron products in North America, that'll equate to about 10 million in US dollars so each year. So that's why I say we've really taken advantage of working with the retailers, understanding what people are looking for and then bringing it online. So that's why I say you go where your customer is shopping. So, you know, the female customer, we're online, we're purchasing on Amazon, we're purchasing direct 
um, on websites. And when we're in the stores, we want to see the product there too. So that's really one of the strengths that I brought into Vitality coming from companies like Best Buy. Uh, they're leaders in omni-channel. And so I brought that into our approach right off the bat was to have that online presence and continue to grow that as we've been growing. All right. Well, with that, before I let you go here today, uh, from what you can tell us, what would you say are some of the company's value catalysts now going into 2022? For sure. I think, you know, we talked about the fact that the business has grown substantially here in Canada. We've actually experienced uh, five years of year over year growth, about 529 percent growth. Um, that's all been in Canada and that's been primarily organic growth. We've just raised $1.5 million in the last 12 months to really accelerate that growth. So the things that you're going to start to see in the next upcoming year is, like I said, that direct to customer, we're bringing in the subscription model online in Canada, as well as we're expanding into the United States. So the largest natural health trade show is a go uh, this year, which is great to see. They just did the East show of 18,000 people and the West show is natural products West uh, occurring in Anaheim in March. So we're also gonna be expanding the product line into the United States, which is the largest market in the world uh, for supplements. So very excited about the year to come and uh, we've got a proven product, a proven method for growth and now it's time to accelerate. Well, with that, Cheryl, where can our audience go and find more information on Vitality products? Great. You can uh, go to our website. It's investinvitality.com. Uh, so right on there, you can find everything from our news releases, our board of directors, and also um, our plans for what's upcoming. Our customer site is vitality.ca, which also gives you a great introduction to the products and why we think we stand out in the marketplace. Very good. Cheryl, thank you so much for joining me today. I really do appreciate it. Good luck. Stay safe. And I look forward to our next update. Thanks, Robert. Look forward to the event. Thank you.